say it together. Me. me. It's a draw. Best out of three. You. Me. You. Ah, I win. Oh, crap. Dope. Okay, so, um, Tranquilizer on him? Gizmo never understood my philosophy regarding the redistribution of wealth, although it's fairly easy, from everyone else to me. And that would be like adding oil to the flames in reverse. He wouldn't know what to do with it. He doesn't even know what to do with himself. Hmm, okay. Um, magnetic field... Mayor low tech and a bag. <laughs> this is practically screaming for a sophisticated maneuver. Ah, ah, but Rufus! You're not untouchable, low tech. Don't you ever forget that. <laughs> oh god. Right. Um we throw a dart in his ass. Is that what we're doing? Ah, ah, but <laughs> Sorry, I suppose. Um <laughs> yeah, that's sort of a disturbing sound. And that would be like adding in reverse. Mm. Focus, Rufus. She can still help you with your. Okay, right. So, how do I do this? I have no clue how to do this. No clue. Never and to Um <sighs> but you're not, don't you? Ah, he's just asleep, right. Didn't get that. Looky here, Wenzel. Did somebody drop food? I mean, what's the deal with the crawling around on the floor? I'm waiting for Gold to wake up so I can take her with me, of course. Ha! Dream on. Although, it is true that ants can carry ten times their own weight. But why would Goal, an Elysian Orbit elf, want to have anything to do with somebody like you? Duh, Rufus! You've always underestimated me. Ugh. Rufus, Rufus! Look at me. I'm a self-made man. Yeah, whoever made you must have stopped right in the middle. Oh, yeah? I am rich. I've got a water vein running through my basement. You, on the other hand, don't even have a basement. You ain't got nothing, Rufus. Hey, that's how you pay people back when they give their best? And what would I want with a basement in Kuvak? I don't belong here, and neither does Gold. And as soon as I wake her up, I will accompany her to Elysium. You'll see. Yeah, but first I need to solve a puzzle. And it obviously involves the sleeping mayor or is it like an emergency thing right now because you can go out can we do an emergency thing to get them out of there I really doubt it's going to be that easy, but, uh, yeah. Hello? I want to report a... Hello? No. Great. Inspector, but as soon as you accident... Uh... Okay, right. So... Hmm. Get Tony to ring one in? What do you got? There? Isn't it enough for you to scatter your crap all over my house? Do you really have to lug it into my store, too? Actually, I wanted to give you a little treat. You could do that by dropping dead. I, I'm not going to do that for you. Just just so you know. Um. Right. How can I distract them? Emergency would be one thing, but they won't listen to me. Hello, Lottie. You again? <clears throat> you, you again? Yes, me again. Um. I'll skid. Don't clip. 
I don't think there's anything left in here, right? I don't... Unless I'm supposed to do something with the message, but I, I, I doubt that. Right, so let me have a think here. Well, it might be... Some maybe helpful if I do it in here. But I just don't... I just don't know what to do. Like, I mean... The, the, the whole bag yeah, thing? This is practically screaming for a sophisticated maneuver. It just seems so obvious that you need to do something with it, but I just don't know what. Um, right, so what can we do? Because he's sleeping, or he's just about falling asleep. And then there's Gizmos just standing there staring at her, so we can't do anything with her. And Wenzel's still there as well. So what are our options, really? Hmm. Yeah, I don't really know. That's frustrating. <laughs> it's kind of frustrating. Um. Come on, Eterna. Think. Think. There's got to be something. Hmm. I'm still thinking, like, uh, what was the message? Odikir not or something? In the mayor's office? I, uh, that, uh, it's probably just an in-joke or something, but to me it doesn't mean anything, to be fair. Um. Hmm. It's probably it it it's gonna be something on the screen though, right? I feel like the the bag is somehow important. Can we can we set his ass on fire? That that seems really yeah. Um, the only f cardboard box is the only other thing I can set on fire that would cause Gizmo to run over, right? Yeah. What's that funny smell? Ah, fire! The town hall's on fire! Fire control mode activated. Firefighter Gizmo at your service. Where is the fire? Over there! The chamber's on fire! Good lord! Don't worry, your fire will be extinguished in no time. Okay, well that's one. Dude, what? That... Um, Rufus, I, I do not agree with with that, with everything you just did. Um, so can I now drop it into her mouth? Will the other two stop me? Don't even think about it, Rufus. Keep your hands off the Elysian, Rufus. Okay. This situation calls for a funnel right there. What? No. What makes you think that? You should be glad that Inspector Gizmo's not around. Hmm. Um, well, he did leave a stethoscope. So we're supposed to make him jump by... I was getting worried I'd have to camp in the cupboard forever. Whoa. So what we got out of that was to him distract him when we got the stethoscope. Well, ah, yes. Medical mode activated. Doctor Gizmo at your service. How's the patient? I'd say the condition <laughs> hasn't changed. Uh. Keep the diagnosis to the doctor, will you? Now, just where is my stethoscope? It's gone. Thieves! Crime in progress. Police mode activated. Officer Gizmo at your service. No one leaves the crime scene. Ah, so now we're locked in. So at least now I know that. Yeah. We were on the right track. So what if I used it on the bag? Huh. Oh, but Rufus! You're not untouchable, Low Tech. Don't you ever forget that. That's enough. I think you're done. Uh, come on, Gizmo. You have more important things to do. Don't tell me how to do my work. Or are you just trying to divert my attention from your guilt? What? That's simply... Aha! 
Here is the missing clue. The last piece that completes the puzzle. The mystery of the thieving mayor has finally been solved. Thieving mayor? How dare you? Put up your hands, Lotek. I have no intention of lifting my hands. You better do what I say. I don't want to. You don't have any choice. I don't? Well, you're fired. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. So what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. <laughs> you can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. Almost there. So I what? Have to make sure You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. Wrong. You're arrested. Yeah, you sort of funnel me. anyway. You're fired. But I arrested you first. <laughs> God. So You're fired I'm anyway. sorry, you Goal. We killed her. I... What... Well... How was that? Me. It was me. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Are you alright? Phew. Oh... oh. What happened? You woke the stranger, the Elysian girl, and then you got knocked out. Goal? Where is she? How is she? She's still a bit confused. I think her implant was seriously damaged by the fall. She is conscious now, but she's just talking gibberish. Can I talk to her? Of course. She's lying over there. I took her into medical custody. Just don't stress her out too much. First and foremost, she needs rest now. No problem. Thanks, doctor. Hmm. Hello? Anyone home? Hum, 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 hum. I'll take that as a yes with limitations. Ah, uh, flash dash gazash? Savvy <laughs> mommy, good old granny. Grumblump? Puzzle false. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> That's fucking adorable. <laughs> Munch grunch? Attack a tick tock. Oh! Knock knock. <laughs> Get a hold of yourself. Soup, 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 Guadeloupe. Huh. She's attractive and fun to talk to. Say, did it hurt a lot when you fell from the sky? <laughs> Oh, come on, that was funny. Nah. Because, I mean, you you really fell from the sky, you know, like an angel. <laughs> Just like in the in the pickup line. <laughs> do, do, do you get it? Goal, it's me, your savior. Toodle, toodle, toodle. What? No, it, it's Rufus. Ooh. Yes. What? You can give me any name you like, babe. Heck, this is totally useless. That woman is completely nuts. Bonkers, honkers, honkers. Oh, what did I expect anyway? That she would take me to Elysium? Elysium. We need to go back to Elysium. What did you just say? Horrible things. The Organon betrayed us. Quick, we need to go back. To Elysium, yes, yes. You, you, you remember what happened? Is that you, Cletus? What? No, I'm not. M my name is Rufus. I saved you. Rufus? I don't understand. Where am I? You, you had a pretty bad fall. The doctor says that you're hallucinating. That's confusing, but... <sighs> I need to get to Cletus. Can you take me to him? Who is Cletus? My fiancé. Oh. You know, I don't know. Maybe you are safer down here. After <laughs> all, you... He'll reward you generously. Let's do it! That, uh, generously, you say? Try to contact Cletus. He will search for me. Yeah, yeah. How generous exactly is generous? Maybe you can reach him using a radio. He's certainly trying to find me. 
Do you really think that's a good idea? I mean, for a fiancé, he didn't really make much of an effort to protect you. Rufus, please. You're the only one I can trust. Yeah, that sounds about right. I really am the only one you can trust. The only one. And you already proved that you're of noble character. Mm-hmm. The burden of the hero. But let's get back to the expression, generous. Rufus, please. Contact Cletus. I would be so very thankful. So very, very thankful. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't know if I could do that. Can Sam one Tomo Polo Lollipop? Peekaboo. But. Utam Swadikoso Loka Shootapop. Oh, the burden of the hero. I always have to be so infinitely generous. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Right, let's uh let's see if the radio just works. Um the radio isn't here. Next, please. Oh, uh, that's not the radio. This technology is there's a message. Oh, oh, huh? Either a cat was jumping. Yeah. Um, was there a radio somewhere? Like an actual radio? I said. Well, that girl's gone. Um. I can't remember if there was an actual radio somewhere. I think my brain's gone retarded or something. I should be able to remember that. Not too many screens. But uh, no, I guess this then makes a pretty good moment because uh, we basically achieved what I wanted to achieve for this set. Even though it t did take me way longer than I thought it would, to be fair. But uh, I guess that's sort of what you get. That's sort of what you get with me and adventure games. But uh, that, yeah, this game is amazing. <laughs> I love playing it. I just love the style. I love the dialogue. It, it's just wonderful. It's wonderful. And it has puzzles that are sort of obvious, yet I don't get them because I'm a dumbass, I think. And then after I figure it out, it's like, oh god, how did you miss that, you idiot? And I can just imagine you guys just yelling at the screen for like half an hour at least. But uh, yeah, um, I did what I wanted. So um, yeah, next set, I guess we'll try and contact Cletus. Should be fun, I think. Maybe. I have no clue how we're going to do that or what's going to happen from here on. Because it can go any any which way now. But I think we'll reach Elysium at some point, right? We have to. But anyway, something's going to be happening because we've been around this town for too long in the game. So something's going to happen. And I'm, I'm pretty sure it's going to be next set. So um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. And I'll see you guys next time. See you, dudes.